Hey Science Seekers, <clears throat> welcome. This is uh, episode five. Good morning to you all. I'm still on uh, spring break and each day I'm trying to get one of the jobs done around the house before I go back to my virtual teaching. So today, again, I'm still kind of obsessed with my paint sprayer. I wanna show you guys today, we're gonna be doing a staining of a fence. Again, more chemistry than anything in this lesson. Uh, so let's take a look. First off, here is our yeah, yesterday's project that I showed you. It's beautiful white, pops really nice. Uh, white, by the way, as a color, reflects all the light from the spectrum, so it's actually much, much brighter now that I put this fresh paint on here. When that light hits here, all the colors from the spectrum of the visible light are bouncing off, which is kind of a cool concept versus black, which absorbs all of them. Um, this is a fence I got installed and has not been stained. Now it's important to understand, <clears throat> you never want to stain a fence or any wood the first year you get it. It's brand new, the wood is not porous enough. Porous means that it will suck up and take in the stain. You can see this is some old fence from a few, many years ago. And uh, the stain's coming off, so we need to respray it off. Um, so, Tip number one, you do not, not want to stain until your wood is porous. It takes about a year of weathering. Weathering means breaking it down and letting the wood kind of get more um, sponge-like, which porous means that when we put the stain on there, it will suck right into the wood. The wood will take it in. Stain. Stain's a little different than paint. Stain, okay, most stains are oil-based. Uh, you always want to check to see whether your paint is oil-based or acrylic-based. Okay, stains, all right, traditionally are with oil in them. So when this stuff gets on you or on anything, it will stick around for a very, very long time. You have to use mineral spirits usually to get it out. Uh, stain doesn't come off easily. So it's important to look and see is yours a plastic acrylic based stain or paint or is it an oil based? Um, stains traditionally are transparent, which means you can see through them a little bit. And when we spray that fence, it'll be a nice bright color, but you'll still be able to see the wood grain and the texture, which is why you would do a stain versus like the paint over here, you're not gonna see any of the wood. So that's our tips on stain versus paint. We're gonna go ahead and stain a fence right now with our paint gun, and we'll see you again tomorrow. Be sure to check in for our next episode. Good luck with your lessons today, kids. See you later.